I didn't even realize that you were very clever with the way that uh, we talked about Dungeons and Dragons back in the day. As you, sorry, yeah, you, you you explained mm -hmm. that you always played paladins mm -hmm. in Diablo, yes. and uh, that was you kind of left it at that. I didn't even realize that you had secretly Given spilled you the tea. That you yeah. didn't know. Like we were double scooping that day. Yeah, um, yeah no, we'd we'd spill a little bit of tea, but you know, it was it was secret tea. It's fun tea. It's uh, we play the long game sometimes. You want to give audiences a sense of payoff and joy and excitement, and I think that's a lot of what we achieved today, which is very exciting. Tell me about the feeling of actually being in Hall H and getting a chance to get that energy from the fans who have all been so eagerly anticipating what this movie could even look or sound or be like. It was, it was a privilege beyond words. There's something about Hall H is a dream for anyone in this community and getting to walk out on that stage and feel that sense of community and excitement is, is unrivaled. It's unmatched. There's nothing like it. And getting to be right in the middle of that and feeling people feel good about the movie we presented. I think that there is such a strong desire, where, particularly in the Comic-Con community, where folks are like, please, can we have a good Dungeons & Dragons movie? And feeling the entirety of Hall H go, oh man, that looks like a good Dungeons & Dragons movie, is the best feeling in the world. All right, tell me about the look of your character. How do you pronounce his name? Is it Zank? Zank. Zank, okay. Zank. Tell me about the look for Zank, starting with the hair. Because mm -hmm. is, it, is it a twist? Is it, is it dreads? Like, what are, what are we working with? I mean, as far as... I'm concerned it's twists, <laughs> but don't get me in trouble here. Um, it was good fun. It was just it was good fun. And I wanted to make sure that we had um, we had a style that would be fun for folks to come to Comic Con in. <laughs> How heavy was the armor, though? I, I heard you know you said yeah. that it it made the sword training, the stance training, did the body well. Um, it, <laughs> the, the body worked on this one, and I made the Tony Stark mistake. I was in very very warm costume that took too long to go to the bathroom in. <laughs> That's a tough thing. Yes. It's, it, I'm not going to make that mistake again. <laughs> But I did enjoy the cape. Okay, listen, it'll be lighter for the sequel. <laughs>